Hey guys, today this video is going to show you how to make this saxophone. For this project, we're going to set our room as little V here and keep your red arrows point away from you. First, we're going to make this part two yellow, started from first to second on your left, second to third, and going this way for four times. Three, and four. Now we're going to use three bands. Continue on here for three times. Two and three. And two. Now we're going to make this part. For that part, I'm going to use one single band twist one two three so you will see four rings here then take one more single band twist only one time you will see two rings here then we're gonna take this and bring this first band in here and put both in on your hook Next, I'm going to take one neon orange and do the same thing. Twist one time. You'll see two rings and bring it in here. Pull it and bring this piece in here. You can pull a little bit so it'll be easier to slide in like this. And put both end on your hook. Now I'm going to take two yellow and bring this piece in here and the same, put both ends on your hook now we're going to press this piece right here first one on your left now we're going to add the bottom here three of them take one single yellow twist one, two, three so you will see four rings here and take one neon orange and bring this piece in here put both ends on your hook now we're going to press this piece on fourth from the bottom one, two, three, four and we're going to keep this on this side we're going to repeat this step and make two more press right here one two take one single yellow twist one two three you see four rings take one neon orange bring it in here put both end on your hook press right here next to it Take one more arrow, twist three times. You'll see four rings, young orange. Bring it in here. And press right here next to it. Now we're going to make this piece. For this piece, I'm going to use the pack here. Maybe we can rotate our room here. So we can use the full pack here. And for the first layer, I'm going to use gold. If you don't have gold, you can use the same color. Like whichever color you use for the body. This part is kind of like we make the pencil topper. Take one single band, twist. You make an egg figure. And then the same. Make an egg figure between these two pegs and we're going to go all the way around you take one single band, make an egg figure between two pegs and do it all the way around here this is our first layer and second layer, we'll just take one yellow band, place right here between two pegs. 
you don't have to twist anymore just press right in and the same go all the way around now you can see four bands on each peg first two is gold on first layer second two is a second layer with yellow band now we're gonna take our hook bring the bottom two move it inside bring the bottom two move it over bottom two move it over and go all the way along bottom two move it over and this is second layer and for the yellow we want to keep all this bent down and for the yellow we're going to make four more layers so total for the yellow is five layers but we already have one here so we're going to need four more if you already know how to do this part you can pass your videos and make four more Just take one single band Place in between two pegs and go all the way around between these four like this and bring the bottom two move inside bottom two move inside bottom two move inside bottom two move inside and this is our second layer of yellow band now let's stir bring the bottom two move inside bottom two move inside bottom two move inside bottom two move inside The fourth bottom two, move it over, bottom two, move it over, bottom two, move it over, bottom two, move it over. Make sure I tell you done. On each peg, you should still have two bands on it. Now we need one more layer. Bottom two, move it over. Bottom two, move it over. Right now at this point you should see two bands on each peg so you want to separate them and then we're going to start with on here go inside this band grab the bottom one hook it to the next one so now this peg has three bands on it so you want to reach in and grab the bottom there and hook it to the next one the same you see three bands on this peg so reach in grab the bottom there hook it to the next one here grab the bottom there hook it to the next one here so now these three are secure and this is a loose end so you want to put your hook in a loose end so make sure you won't lose it and take it off and just bring all four if you lose the other three that's fine you just need to put it back in or you don't have to since we got loose end on the first one so we're kind of safe after you take it out we're gonna take two bands and bring this whole piece inside these two bands you can pull it a little bit so it's easier to bring it through 
like this and put both ends on your hook now we're going to place this piece right here last one let's keep it now we're going to start looping reach in grab the bottom two we'll get to the next one now this is three bands so grab all the bands hook it to the next one and we're going to continue to do this all the way to the end of the loom here Now after you're done here, put your hook through here. Now after you're done here, put your hook through here. Take one single band, grab it through. Put both ends on your hook. Take one end through the others and pull it so you tie a knot here. Now it's time to take it off. So after you take it off, we're going to hide this secure band here. You can just drop it around, around here, or you can hide it just somewhere close by. Put your hook through, grab the secure band, and bring it through, like this. Or if you have a hard time hiding it, you can just drop it around on the head here. And this is our saxophone. Thank you for watching. See you next time.